There are three stages when a baby is born. The first stage is when your body slowly opens up so the baby can come out. Your uterus, the muscle around your baby, squeezes and relaxes. These are called contractions. They help your cervix, the opening to the uterus, stretch from closed to about 10 centimeters wide, which is about the size of a big cookie. This first stage is the longest and has three parts. This is the very beginning and it's the easiest part. It can last from a few hours to a few days. It starts slowly, so you have time to get used to the feeling. Your contractions might be far apart, like every 20 to 25 minutes and short, lasting only half a minute to less than a minute. Your cervix opens from zero to five centimeters. You might see some thick pink stuff come out. That's the mucus plug, which has been keeping germs out during pregnancy. If this happens at night, try to rest or sleep. If it's daytime, stay upright and move gently. This helps the baby move down into your pelvis. A warm bath or a nice massage can make you feel better. You should also eat and drink a little. You'll need the energy later. And make sure to pee often, even if you don't feel like it. An empty bladder gives your baby more room to move down and helps your uterus squeeze better. This is when things get more serious. Your contractions become stronger and come more often about every two to three minutes, and each one lasts around a minute. Your cervix keeps opening until it's about eight centimeters wide. This is the time to head to the hospital. This is the toughest part of the first stage. Your contractions are very strong and might come every two minutes lasting about a minute and a half. There's almost no break between them. It's normal to shake, shiver, feel sick, or even throw up as your body works hard to finish opening your cervix all the way to 10 centimeters. Once that happens, your baby starts moving down into the birth canal, the pathway out. You might feel a lot of pressure in your bottom, like you need to poop. This is when your body may start to feel the urge to push. Sometimes your water, the bag of fluid around your baby, will break during this stage if it hasn't already. As your baby moves down, their head turns to fit under your pubic bone. When your baby gets to the opening of your vagina, you'll be able to feel the top of their head during contractions. At first, the head might slide back in between contractions. That's normal. Then, at some point, it stays at the opening even when you're not having a contraction. This is called crowning. Many moms feel a strong boning or stinging as the baby's head stretches the skin. But it only lasts for one or two contractions, and then your baby is born. Right away, your baby is placed on your belly, dried off, and covered with a blanket. This skin-to-skin -skin time is super important for bonding and starting breastfeeding. The third stage of labor is when you deliver the placenta, the organ that's been feeding your baby during pregnancy. This part usually takes 5 to 30 minutes. Thanks for watching. You can check out my other videos to learn about how breastfeeding works or what happens during a C-section.